the last time we saw the kitchen area, it wasn't this. This. And if you ain't no nigga, I'm popping. I'm the one nigga who be not this. Fresh and clean, you can say you know the vibe. Man, you send nobody, I can live my life. Barada. Wow, I mean, just like you, I'm also wondering, how then did we get here? Why is everything expensive? Let's take it from the beginning. First of all, this place is hot as hell because I've not been here for the past two weeks and I don't know how, but they disconnected me from the light. I did not ask for this. Tell me how I just met the carpenter and my total bill for just a cabinet. A cabinet just to hold my sink is 850 CDs minus the sink itself. And everything I want, I'm more. I do your door and I no go come more. So I went to get the sink in the morning and I had options. Initially I wanted to get this small one because it was so small but then looking at it I would have done a lot of work because it didn't have the hole, it didn't have anything. I have to purchase everything all over again and so I saw this one and I'm like I think this is already worked on and this one will be okay. It had hole, it had everything except the pipe of which I'll buy later on and I got it for 240 CDs. And now tell me why the carpenter who is going to install the sink on the cabinet says he's taking 250 CDs and everything that I have to buy for the installation ends up to 600 CDs. How? I saw same sink at China Mall going for 890 CDs. Why didn't I buy that one? Because I want to be involved in the whole process of me moving now from kitchen to everywhere, I want to do it myself. I hate African parents for this. They never taught us how to build. I'm not trying to be ungrateful though, but then it's like we lack at basic things. <sighs> not sponsored. Yeah, it's exactly two days after I last put with you guys and it's still not sorted out the carpenter issue, but I got this 3D wallpaper for the kitchen. Right about now, we're going to be doing some installation there. And basically, maybe the side too as well, depending on. Let me see. Ooh, that's nice. Look at that. I mean, do you guys still remember this place? It used to be my deck space where magic did happen. <laughs> so the thing is yesterday, my mom got a carpenter who was willing to deassemble the deck space if I wouldn't use it and use the plywood in conjunction with maybe a few plywood to build the same cabinet. I was so surprised this man came and then we budgeted somewhere 200 CDs. I mean, two fucking hundred cities oh my god it's so nice the carpenter did amazing he tried to like do it so nice for me all right good morning i still have a lot of things to do <coughs> this wasn't supposed to be here and this also was not supposed to be here everything was supposed to be lined here that's why we have the sticker but this guy here is so huge that it wouldn't fit here and meaning this guy won't fit here and i'm planning of making a shelf <laughs> Dreaming, I just want the feeling of you in my bed. So, 
after shelving, I kind of figured out my mood for the kitchen is not all that white white. Let me just add some other, you know, color to it. And I opted for the beige color. And oh my god. Look at the color. Initially, it was just white and then this wallpaper. But I have this beige color matching with the wallpaper as well. I decided to leave this place white as it is and just yeah make this place the beige color and then leave the top here white basically that's how the painting is looking like right now we need to arrange the stuffs on the shelves some few days of intense kitchen makeover this is the final look not really the final look i mean as time goes on we'll be adding and removing some of the styles but since i'm living here now this is the kitchen and so yeah basically this is how it's looking right now from the one when i got here and it was looking like so awful i told myself this has to be done minimal on the budget but the outcome should be amazing i can't wait to start cooking and be sharing all the recipes that i want you guys to see a lot of people have been saying i'm sweet and jelly i like it but i just i just can't wait for you guys to see what you'll be doing here so basically this is the kitchen right now you guys have seen it and i hope you guys enjoyed it as much as i did in the whole process this is going to be amazing as times go on we'll be upgrading it especially this of which i don't want to talk much because it will be a whole makeover that i don't give a spoiler I'll let you guys you love what i'll do here just relax so here without further i hope you guys enjoyed the video as much as i did don't forget to give me a big thumbs up don't forget to comment something nice don't forget to subscribe share and let me meet you on 